Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are on episode 37 of Smack Talk here at Smart Gal Moment. I am your host, as always, Tony Mango. History in the making today. We got all three people back. Brain Bra- Mayhew's still gone for a little bit, but we have the Dace Man, we have Michael Burhan, and we have Chris Urban. <laughs> it's not really pronounced that way, but what the hell? I wanted the rhyme. Hey, Urban, Urban Italiano. <laughs> Uh, we had a short, short show tonight it's because not a whole lot of shit's been going on. And what the hell, why not throw things into uh, hot tags instead of throwing little segments and making me do a whole bunch of extra work? Also, uh, Dace's appearance fee is worth too much. So, yeah. I'm paying we, per part. Yeah. <laughs> uh, first things first, Mike, do you have an ask him for us? Yes, I do. And I promise it's not about corpses. Um, off to a good start. <laughs> I don't believe him. <laughs> okay, this one. Which country sucks ass? Brazil. <laughs> Days has been suspended immediately. For <laughs> Smack talk. Who tweeted the president of Brazil that Jericho's the best in the world at kicking their flag? Chris Urban. <laughs> that is and now terrible. Urban's been released for 30 days. Released. <laughs> yeah, released for 30. <laughs> be back at 30. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I, I promise I will get this done. Okay. Um, this is actually a, a kind of fun one, depending if anyone is actually going to get this or not. Nancy Benoit. But we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I heard about the episode. It sounds great. I'm glad to be a part of this. <laughs> <laughs> you see, Dace doesn't do things by halves. He doesn't actually watch the episode. He just hears about it. Oh, it was tweeted about. <laughs> I was fucking a corpse. I assumed it was Nancy Benoit. <laughs> uh, oh, God. I was there's, that no, there's really no wrestling talk tonight. We're just going to talk about ourselves. <laughs> All right, what's the ask him for the week? <laughs> okay. in a, Kind of in celebration of Paul Heyman, because I'm a Heyman guy. If you're not, then you all can go fuck yourselves. Um, what? <laughs> What I'm going to do is I'm actually um, going to talk about somebody that he's actually managed. So here's your first clue. The person was actually managed by Paul Heyman in um, the WCW. And he was actually one of the first... He made his name... In WCW, under Paul Heyman and a certain group, he then went on to lose the United States Championship to someone who thinks very highly of himself. And if you've checked out the wrestling news sites, you'll know who I'm talking about. And then went on to become a main eventer after getting a rather generic... uh, generic uh, gimmick. Who is he? Can I buzz in? Yes. Or is this just Tony? That's no, everybody. Rick Rude. Nope. Bullshit. Seven. No idea. No idea? Okay. Um, so he had the US title in WCW. Yes, before losing it to a rather um, unappealing wrestler. If you, you probably know who he is, the guy he lost it to, because the guy's been all over the wrestling boards uh, the last couple of days for saying rather controversial <clears throat> things. Scott Steiner, right? Nope. Damn. All right, well, then I have no fucking idea. Okay, I have, I, I have to do it. Oh, tough guy. Really? He managed that's to know he lost it to. And That's the guy he lost it to. Oh. Come on. Lost it to Duggan. Fuck. And he was managed in the WWE by a gentleman who had a very funny laugh. Who would always go, ha, 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 ha. Virgil. <laughs> I win. Game over. I don't think Virgil's ever going to be the answer for anything. <laughs> Game over. Is it Steve Austin? Yes. Really? Yes. Yes. Chris yes. Yes. 
times. No, that means you've got the Ask Him next week, though, so you've got to think of something. Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't work for next week. <laughs> I got I to gotta film next week's show, too? Come on, I thought it was like once every two months. <laughs> no, no, you have to really work for your, like, $5. Oh, fuck me in the ass. You get paid for this? $5? I can't afford that shit. You think I can afford $5 with YouTube taking down my monetization all the time from their fucking glitches? Is it because of the Nancy Benoit comments? <laughs> no, it's actually, because they're dipshits. Very surprisingly, they haven't actually attacked the Nancy Benoit videos. No. I've gotten more heat over the uh, Ultimate Warrior ones than that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, all right, well, we're going to move into the hot tags right now. But you know what? This time, instead of having this all in part one, because we don't really have a whole lot going on, I'm going to break this up. I'm going to put this in part two. So the hot tags are going to be in part two, and then we'll move on to the Hottest Stevenson Knockouts Tournament in part three. 